Hello everyone. Welcome to Python Learning Series for Network Engineers. This is the third video on how to do multi-threading in Cisco DBS configuration backup. In the first video, we have seen how to initiate SSH to a device, execute show command, and store the output into a text file. In the second video, we have seen how to do multi-threading. We are using threading and there we have used threading.thread and we were passing our function Cisco backup function and we have a list of devices here we have four devices and we are passing the device details as arguments args and here we are looping through each device and each thread we are doing a start and then we create a list here backup thread list and we're looping through that list and doing a join now in this video we'll see how to schedule this particular task like the configuration backup task we'll try to run this every 15 seconds automatically how to schedule it using the schedule library in python so this we are going to use this module so you need to manually install it you need to install it using pip install or you can go to PyCharm and install it. You need to go to the settings, project, and you need to install it. I already have installed it. Now, before that, we'll try running this script once. So, this is connecting parallelly to all these four devices. And taking configuration backup and storing it here you can see the timestamp here so everything all these backups happened almost at the same time now to schedule this i'll first import schedule then we'll look into the site here we have multiple options like in our case this is going to be our configuration backup function then we need to give schedule every 15 seconds we'll give then we need to give a while loop so let us just define that so we are calling this particular function inside our multi-threading so what we need to do is we will define a function here I will call that function as backup thread and we will call this particular backup thread function in our schedule schedule dot every 15 seconds dot do and then we can pass our this particular backup thread function and after that we need to introduce a while loop while true schedule dot run pending You can see here even inside do also we can pass arguments or keyword arguments for example if we have some arguments passing here that time we can even pass that as well here inside this so let us just try running this okay, we'll give a time dot sleep as well Okay, we'll try running this. So initially it will be waiting for 15 seconds.
yeah first execution has been completed it started at 16341 yeah yeah next backup has started so that also got completed So based on your requirement you can just add the schedule here to demonstrate I have added 15 seconds so it is continuously taking the configuration backup earlier I have created one video on how to run this in the backend without op keeping the terminal open like using no hub method I will add that video also in the description and notification So I'll stop this and we should be able to see all the configuration backups. In the next series we'll see how to do some configuration parsing using regular expression like how to parse the show run output and uh, show IP interface brief output and create a dictionary of interface properties and all. I hope this video was helpful for you to understand how to do multi-threading and how to schedule that based on the frequency requirement thanks for watching see you in the next video